Hi, Dr. Joe here with something interesting. Here's the time when asthma, high fever, and all those things get into everything. And here's something from PubMed, which is really very interesting. In other words, it is L-arginine, if I can get it right, L-arginine uh, supplementation and experimental airway obstruction hyperactivity. This is asthma, even though I can't read that title as fast as I should. Uh, asthma is big time in the middle of summer, lots of allergens and so forth. So what they did is they took a couple things into consideration. First of all, the tone of the arteries in around the lungs are one thing. Secondly, the tone of the airways, that which strictures down and causes the wheezing, which is such a famous uh, feature of what asthma is all about. And there are allergens, that's hay fever, and the kind of thing that a lot of pollens go in you and make things different and make you wheeze, and also irritants, smoking, if you did, and other things that could actually just inhale from a freeway or something like that. So that they looked at the allergens and the irritants, and what they ended up finding is a situation where the muscle rea reactivity, that is the muscle, the smooth muscle, around the bronchioles, that's the smallest little airways that go wee wee when you whiz, whiz through the uh, problems of asthma. And by virtue of this, they had a big difference by using L-arginine. The key thing is they were talking about also uh, that there's other things, so uh, we go back to what I look at and they talked about in a different paper of how vitamin D can get rid of a lot of asthma. So suddenly we're seeing the tripwire for everything that goes wrong with a lot of things. You say, how did I get that? Well, you inherited part of that tendency, yeah. But you can take your smooth muscles just like the arginine does for arterioles, and it can make things different. So all of a sudden you don't need to worry about your situation so much. You're going to need a lot of D. It takes maybe three uh, months to a year, and that's what they found in Australia, as I've talked about before. But this is something you can do all that you're changing in your lifestyle and everything, supplementation where you need it, and get rid of all these damn things. You can get rid of asthma. It's cool. It really is your time.